up one more undercard fight in the main event. What do you say? Are you ready for your final undercard fight of the night? Introducing first, he walks like his girlfriend after she fucks a black guy, Jack Freeman! Next Sunday. Yeah. What? Yeah. Jack Freeman, how you doing, oh, mate? Uh, I feel good, man. I'm invited to the cookout. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I had, uh, I had to, I had to ask a homeless guy what that song was about. Oh. Yeah. You ready for this fight, Jack? Fuck yeah, dude. Let's it. All right, we're gonna meet your opponent. His last name is Smart, but his hand is retarded. Tommy Smart. <laughs> How you doing tonight, Tommy? Yes. You ready for this fight? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Five jokes, tip for tat. Tommy, Jack, which one of you two would like to go first? <laughs> Jack's going first, Tommy's going second. Fight Club, what do you say? Are you ready for this fight? Five jokes starting with Jack. This fight starts now. All right, y'all. My name is Jack. Uh, both Tommy and I, we both have birth defects. That's what uh, this whole shit is about, dude. <laughs> Tommy does not identify as disabled, which is okay because the rest of us do. Yeah. <laughs> so Jack's entire ass is like he's crippled, but his disability is just walking like every cool black guy in every movie. <laughs> <laughs> so this is proof, living proof, that white people will do anything to be called diverse. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tommy Smart's uh, full name, Tommy Smart, man. Actually, people don't know this. He gave himself that name because it was the only phrase he could say for 17 years of his life. Tommy Smart. Tommy Smart. Tommy Smart. It's not for so Jack's girlfriend broke up with him during the Women's History March. Apparently Jack's leg isn't the only thing that's looking. <laughs> oh, shit, all right. All right, man, let's, let's do this. <laughs> I actually, I love and respect Tommy a lot, because he, he lives his best life no matter what, you know? Like, a lot of people would not become a stand-up comedian despite being so visibly not funny. <laughs> Alright, so Jack, believe it or not, dates a lot. Shocker. Alright. He's on all the dating apps. His favorite is Life Alert. <laughs> uh, Tommy's older brother died when he was seven years old. <laughs> it's actually just his black friend. <laughs> Tommy's brother died when he was seven years old, and that tragedy left his parents with half a son. Alright, so Jack wasn't allowed to ride the 
short bus when he was in school. Because <laughs> he wasn't mentally retarded. Um, Wish the teachers heard his jokes. That's <laughs> <laughs> really Alright. Last joke. Last joke, man. Tommy's family is Catholic. And I could have guessed that because Tommy made it full term. <laughs> great-great-great-grandmother just got cream clapped by a black guy. <laughs> <laughs> to my shoulder and said, Jack is froggy. <laughs> I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. He's the best froggy he's ever been. I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what's wild, dude. Your jokes hit so hard. And then you hit him with a good laugh, but look at his laugh. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that is what it is. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, dude, Jack hit harder, and uh, Tommy, I love you, buddy, but hit with your right. <laughs> That's another vote for Jack. We're going to go to you guys' fight club. Do you think the winner of this fight is Jack Freeman? <laughs> or is the winner of this fight Tommy Smart? Round <laughs> <laughs> up goes to Jack, but Tommy fucking can't give it up for Tommy. Yeah. 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 This battle is made. I give an arm and a leg for every battle to be this good. Yeah. 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 Yo, yo, Tommy is amazing because I've never met a three fifths white person. He's always look like he's checking the time. That's crazy. Yo, that was so funny, I made him walk again. Yo, I'm going to go for the, the better reason. <laughs> Jack has a disability, but still laughs like a black guy. Hey, shit! <laughs> Jack's got it wrapped up, but Allie O'Neill, final thoughts on the fight. Oh my god, I love watching a fight between Forrest Gump and a guy who's a per permanently a fancy waiter. <laughs> I love that. This was actually a really fun fight. You guys were both awesome. I, I think that you both had really, really good jokes. Sorry to be uh, actually uh, judging here. Both um, both no, yeah, they're both real special. This reminds me. <laughs> this reminds me. I was I was in the special ed classes because I couldn't read, and then I was in classes with guys like this. Can you believe that? Um, we, but... believe, we believe it. We believe it. <laughs> Dude, I grew up in Boston. They just put me in there because I had red hair. <laughs> they were like, something's wrong with her, dude. <laughs> Um, but this was a fun fight. You guys were awesome. I, I think your jokes were great, Tommy, but I just think that your delivery needs to be like punchier. Like, I think if you had more confidence, you would, guys would have been like, That's a fact. Uh, Telling me needs to be punchier, Allie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I seem to have uh, talked myself into a corner here. <laughs> but you guys are great, and it's gotta go to Jack. <laughs>